craziest bastards I've ever met in my life. I love everyone. Crazy bastards, sons of wrestling, happy Memorial Day, and tonight's biggest news was John Cena returns to Raw, and uh, well, he wasn't well received by one AJ Styles and the club beat him down. This was awesome. AJ Styles comes in and the handshake, respect. And actually, before AJ Styles showed up to WWE, John Cena did that tweet, or it was an Instagram photo of AJ Styles in his younger years. So this was awesome. And now you got the club back together. The click that is, they are back together. And who else is going to join? It looks like with this whole SmackDown brand split deals, SmackDown being live, this opens up so many opportunities for so many other wrestlers. I am so excited for it. Let me know what you guys think. Down below in the comments, tell me, are you excited for this SmackDown Live thing that's going to happen, which I swear is going to pull in NXT somehow on, say, Raw stays three hours, SmackDown's two. You could throw on NXT with SmackDown on the USA Network. Like, this, this is great. This is awesome, and so many good things are going to happen with WWE, and this causes uh, a lot, lot of just heads banging, and uh, just everybody's going to be ready to go, and they're going to want, you're going to see the hunger in the guys and the girls. This is awesome. So good news. So we'll see what's going to happen, and we all got the hatch reveal. Hatch, the, like the lost uh, thing that they had going on on Twitter, ends up being Goldberg for 2K17. Goldberg back with the WWE, much like Ultimate Warrior was uh, a couple years ago, where he did come in with uh, WWE's uh, wrestling game there, and then was part of the show until his. Uh, yeah, unfortunate passing. So hopefully Goldberg does ride in. Unfortunately, Ryback is gone. So either way, Goldberg back with WWE. We'll see where it goes. We'll see what happens. And uh, to start off the show tonight, Shane and Steph come out, separately that is, to open up Raw and then the New Day. They come out and we get exactly what Taz said on the Taz show about the brand split and the New Day possibly can get split up and they're wondering where they're gonna be. Then the Vaude Villains come out and we get a match and uh, New Day versus Vaude Villains very short, Anderson and Gallows attack the New Day. It looks like they got their eye on the prize, the tag team titles, so that's pretty cool. Then we have the Usos versus Brazango and the Usos pick up an easy victory, and you have Golden Truth on commentary, so they get blamed for this, and uh, it turns into um, Gold Dust and R-Truth beating down Brazango, so it is what it is. So, we have some tag team matches rolling heavy tonight on Raw. Then we got Reigns, comes out to the ring, calls out Rollins, Rollins teases a fight, keeps coming back and forth, back and forth, but never does come in, and that's that. So, um, Reigns, the boos are pretty good, and the cheers are pretty good as well. So I'll give it to him there, and we'll see what happens. And, hey, with this brand split going on, who knows, man? At least they acknowledged it, and it's happening. And uh, things are gonna happen a little bit until SmackDown goes live, and that's gonna be pretty damn cool. Then we got Rusev versus Ryder. Monster accolade to Zack Ryder. Another thing that Taz predicted on a show that they're going to want him doing that goddamn monster accolade. Where actually it doesn't look as crazy anymore. The way it's put on. So either way. Anyway, U.S. chants get going. And uh, it looks like uh, Titus O'Neil just... He has it in for Rusev. Blasts Rusev in the face, right in the jaw. Cracks him a good one. Glad to see Titus O'Neil back. Great talent. Monster. What a beast. So, 
Maybe he's got his eye on the U.S. title where we all thought John Cena was coming back for that. And, you know, didn't happen. Then we got Enzo and Kaz. Awesome promo. Yes, I liked it. Some people don't like these guys, but I'm telling you, this rocked. <laughs> and they get a match against the Dudleys, and hell yes. They get the rocket launcher finish on the Dudleys. They pick up the win, and I don't think the feud is over yet. It's going to continue on, and these guys can go back and forth and give Bully Bubba Ray the mic. I mean, Bully Ray. That guy, give him the mic. Come on. Then... John Cena says the future must go through him and uh, while he's back. And then uh, AJ Styles comes out and then, uh, you know, the handshake and all the respect and all that. Gallows and Anderson come out, you know the rest. AJ Styles turns and just keep beating down Cena. Leaves, comes back, beats down Cena. Leaves, comes, comes back, beats down Cena. So the click is back together. So, uh... Come on up, Finn Balor. Join the crowd, and I think, seriously, Seth Rollins is going to join in as well. Look at the shirt. You can't go wrong. So anyway, we move on to Natty versus Dana Brooke. Quick Dana victory here. Charlotte's out of the ring, and then they beat down Natty. So. And then, what I did like this, Becky Lynch in for the save. Becky Lynch should still be in the title picture. She is a phenomenal talent. Then we have uh, Baron Corbin versus Dolph Ziggler. Dolph Ziggler puts on his headgear as back in the days of amateur wrestling when he was in college. And he returns the favor of the low blow. Just blasts Corbin in the cock. And there you go. Screw it. That's it. And we move on to the main event, which actually all these guys are great talents. Just wasn't enough steam built up into this, not enough time. Ambrose, Cesaro, and Zayn versus Jericho, Owens, and Del Rio. Dirty deeds to Owens in the end to finish it off. Everybody's trying to hit their finishers. Spa fest pretty much, but hey, dirty deeds in the end for the, the win, the victory here. So, in all right, Raw kept my attention enough. Lots of tag work. I thought Teddy Long was in the back, but he never did come out. Leia. So anyway, comment below. Hit the thumbs up. I'll catch you guys next time. Money in the Bank is coming soon. And these uh, pay-per-views always do come faster than you expected. So this brand split thing, though, let me know what you guys think. I think it's great. I think it's perfect. And when is Triple H going to make a return on Raw and probably shake things up pretty big. I'll catch you guys next time.